You look familiar. Don't I know you from somewhere? Ever been to Australia? No, me neither. Good burger bonanza. It would be disrespectful not to visit the king. Kiss the ring. Hey, I'd like to get uh, three smoked BBQ bacon Bufords. Combos or just the sandwiches? Just the sandwiches. Three barbecue bacon Bufords, okay. And then three bacon Zillas. First stop for the birthday burger bonanza bash, 30 burgers, where we're getting some classic cheeseburger. We're gonna fuck them up. R2, motherfuckers. The time is now. Burger time! Come on and grab your friends. We're gonna eat some fucking burgers. Woo! Happy birthday to the Happy guy birthday. that jerks off and doesn't do any work. Shut up, Joe. Get back to work. <laughs> Look at what we got. What do we got? We got some Let's bags. We got some. Smash burger. Smash we got burger. Some... White Castle. Brandy. Just repeat everything burger I say, King. Doug. Yeah, yeah. It's all good. I got what a. What the fuck is that? Thirty dollar deal. What about no dollar deal? Son. Look at all those orders that are not gonna get done. <laughs> oh! oh! It's burger time. Man, how much money are you going for, Arb? You got a Smash Burger? I'm about to smash those burgers. Yeah, I went for the um, Red Robin Burger. Which one are you going for, bro? I don't know. I'm thinking. Chicken there she is. Get some chicken chili yeah! cheese. Happy birthday, dear Dan Martyr. Happy birthday to you. Spit on him. Blow! Harder. Wow, what a great audience. We're not here to talk about my accolades, though. We are here to talk about you and the fact that your friends, uh, Quinn and Lisa, wow, they rave about you and they want to do something truly special for your birthday. They say that you love wrestling and music, that you are the funniest and by far craziest guy they know, and that you started your own custom vinyl making record label called In the Clouds out of your garage. And brother Dan, they tell me you are killing it. That's awesome. There's nothing like a little bit of vinyl, right? Uh, who? They, people, I'm old enough to remember when people thought vinyl's dead. They came in with a cassette. Now no one plays those things. Vinyl's back in a big way. There's nothing quite like listening to the old-fashioned thing. The groove, the pops, uh, those things are every bit as sacred to me as the uh, sounds themselves.